Good afternoon, Falcon fans. We are here with a big announcement, an exciting announcement, and a quick little interview uh, of our new athletic director, Sarah Gustin Hamrock. Sarah, congratulations and uh, welcome to Grantham. Welcome to Messiah College, soon to be university. Thank you so much, Matt. I'm so excited to be a part of the Messiah family and I'm ready to get started. Uh, it'll be a couple of weeks yet before I'm on campus, or maybe any of us are on campus, but. Um, I'm excited to get started and get to know everybody and, um, and lead the department. Absolutely. We're in kind of a unique situation right now. I can't sit down with you face to face, uh, but wanted to get you in front of Messiah University and the Falcons and make sure everybody could see your face, hear your voice and get to know you just a little bit. Uh, I'll start off with a softball question. Would love to just get to know you and, and get to know uh, your family and, and who's coming to Grantham and, and, what should we expect from, uh, from you joining us in uh, the athletic department? Yeah, sure. So I'm a SoCal kid, grew up in Southern California and went away to school. I went to Michigan State. I grew up in a really small town, graduated with 26 kids and wanted to go big time. That was, that was my dream. That was my goal. So I went to Michigan State and played volleyball. Um, and from there, I, I kind of knew that, you know, volleyball and sports played a huge role in my life and I wanted to stay in it. So I got into coaching. And so I coached volleyball for 16 years. And through that, just being all over the country, um, along the way, I met my husband in San Diego and we got married and he is active duty uh, military. And so we moved to DC about seven years ago. Um, and right before uh, that, when we had first met, I knew that administrative administration was kind of the way I was leaning towards going in athletics. Um, I felt like I could make a really big impact uh, from the administrative level and, and being able to impact more student athletes and make more impact in our communities through sport. And that's what I loved about the profession and, and that role. Um, we're excited. I have, you know, just a little bit about me. You kind of asked, asked that. And, um, Said I'm, I'm married, been married for eight, seven, seven years. Been married for seven years. We have a, a daughter, 18 month old daughter. Her name is Kate. She's, you know, you have kids, you know what it's about. It's, it's the best. Um, so she's, she's just amazing. And by the way, she is in the 100th percentile for height. I'm 6'2. Um, my husband's 6'4. Kate is already 35 inches or something at, a, at 18 months old. And, it's pretty remarkable. Um, so we're all going to be moving up really soon. We found a house. We're excited. Um, and we're just, we're ready to be part of the community and, um, and, and cheer on everybody uh, at Messiah, not just athletics, but the whole institution, you know, that's what it's about. So I'm excited to do that. That's great. That's great. You mentioned a couple of places you've been all around the country at all different levels and seen a lot in college athletics, uh, which is super exciting. Would love to know what drew you to Messiah and, and drew you to the Falcons. Yeah, absolutely. that's a great question. So I, I will be honest, I didn't know about Messiah until I started working in D3. I'm not from the East Coast. Like I said, I'm from the West Coast. So unless you're from this side of the country, I think you might have heard for, of it. Um, when I started working in D3, I quickly became familiar with Messiah because of um, the tradition and the legacy that the athletic department has. Uh, I think that the number one thing that draws me to Messiah is the faith community and um, being able to live out your mission to influence students and um, and help them mature in their in their journey through college. It's a transformative time, and you know I I view our role in athletics as um, as being mentors and, and um, spiritual mentors as well as athletic and kind of life mentors for our students. And what drew me to Messiah was just that real and true alive faith that I felt was, was here. And, and that doesn't mean that everybody is at the same place with their faith. It means, you know, I was drawn to the mission of the institution to kind of mentor students in that. Um, yeah, you mentioned student athletes. We have tons of them, um, and a lot of those. There's initiatives around on on how to build community amongst our student athletes, how to enhance their experience, um, and really the student athlete experience. Uh, ultra important to everything that we do. 
what are some initiatives that are on your plate um, that are on the docket that you're really excited about jumping into, whether that be in the first 90 days, that first semester or so, um, or in the first year, just kind of the short term uh, that are areas that you're really excited about leaning into and, and enhancing in the early going? Yeah. So one of my areas of expertise is in leadership development. And I feel like one of the things that I will look to do very soon and immediately if possible is uh, start a leadership development program for our student athletes. Um, I think that that can have a huge impact on their experience. And, and I want to provide that training, not just to our student athletes, but to our coaches as well. Um, you know, I think, I'm stepping into a position where there's some outs, a lot of all outstanding coaches, and I'm really excited to work with them and to, to mentor them as much as we mentor our student athletes. Um, so our coaches have the most impact on our student athletes, and so it's important for me to feed into them so that they can feed into the student athletes um, at the highest level that we're able to, to do that. Some of the things that, other than the leadership development program, I think it's really important for our student athletes to interact together, not just not be silos and teams out there, you know, on their own. I really want us to interact together and to come together. So I'd love to know in these tough times, if there's a message you have for our student athletes, um, as you are walking through the door for the first time uh, here on July 1st, what do you want the, the student athletes to know about who you are or, or if there's any, any tidbits that you'd have for them um, as they come back this fall? I'm so excited to meet the student athletes. Um, you know, this, they are the reason that we all do what we do in athletics. You know, we, we wake up in the morning and we're thinking about how, how can I make somebody's day better today? How can I make a student athlete's day better? Um, and so I hope that you get that from me when you meet me, when I get to meet each of you. I'm, you know, I'm just, I'm excited to meet you and to get to know you and to know what drives you. So I hope to have a lot of conversations with a lot of student athletes and meet you as soon as I can. This is a tough time. We're not just, you know, we're, we're in the midst, not just of COVID right now, we're in the midst of some, some serious civil unrest and, and it's, um, it's heartbreaking to watch and to see. And, and so my message is, um, you know, I want to celebrate, I want to celebrate our differences because in the end we're, we all, we are all the same and we got to come together and we got to, we will be stronger by coming together as a community. Um, and we can, we have the ability to make an impact on our communities when it comes to what's happening in the world today. So I wanna, I wanna say that to encourage you, to motivate you, um, and to just excite you about what's in store for you coming back to campus. And, um, and in addition, I'm, you know, I'm so excited to watch you compete. Um, I'm a very competitive person. Um, you will see that when you meet me, I'm, and I'm, very serious about competition, I would say. Uh, so I'm so excited and thrilled to just be on the sidelines cheering people on. So you will see me. Um, and when you see me, please say hi. And um, I want to welcome you back with open arms because I know this has been a tough, tough road. Um, there's a lot of things going on right now that are that are hard for all of us. So I'm excited to get us back together. Um, with your teams, with your friends, and with your coaches. So as soon as we can do that, safe as we can, we'll do it. I love it. Sarah, I know this is a, maybe a different way of doing this, but uh, I really appreciate you sitting down and taking some time um, to chat with me and to chat with the rest of, of Falcon Nation and everyone out there that's uh, supporting Messiah Athletics. And we can't wait to see you uh, on campus here in about a month. And can't wait to see everybody back on campus this fall for uh, another edition of Messiah Athletics uh, beginning hopefully this fall. And we'll be, be keeping everybody posted on what's going on uh, over the next few weeks. But uh, Sarah, thanks again. Appreciate you sitting down and uh, we'll see you in a few weeks. Yeah. Thank you, Matt. Thanks, everybody. Can't wait to meet you. <laughs>